Hello, it's Matthew Hopkinson here from the local data company. Um, first, I'd like to apologise to all of you present at the Coventry meeting that I can't attend in person uh, due to personal uh, circumstances. So I apologise for that as I'd like very much looking forward to coming up. So uh, Ava's going to obviously take you through what we covered uh, in the Grimsey review. And with regard to the local data company, Neil can take you through in more detail. I think one of the key findings that came out was about understanding places uh, and the whole idea of a town centre commission uh, and really a business plan uh, for town and city centres. Now Coventry is uniquely positioned, it has a very interesting history and it's very well connected by uh, airports, uh, motorways uh, and to a lesser extent train stations and therefore that's a great opportunity but also it's a great threat. Um, I've put together some slides which sort of summarise uh, some of what's going on but for me I think it's very important that Coventry understands its position within the retail and leisure hierarchy within the region and works out how it attracts visitors, um, residents and indeed workers uh, to the city centre to create a vibrant and economically viable uh, community where businesses can thrive. So as part of that, where we sit within the picture of the local data company is that we're able to, one, identify where Coventry sits relative to Warwick, Stratford, and indeed uh, the Bullring and other large mega mall destinations within the region because they're increasingly becoming more important for consumers who spend the day out. The other thing that we're able to do is understand what is going on with various sectors, the chains, how are they behaving, because a number of them are closing stores, but a number of them are also opening, and in what types, because planning becomes a key part of understanding how uh, you should uh, adjust the planning policy within the city to accommodate the right retail types. And as all part of that, it's about having the right stock to encourage and enable uh, these growing and aspiring retailers to come to a city such as Coventry. And we're well positioned to understand who these retailers and sectors are. And we work with a number of organisations identifying uh, those who are expanding, which then enables you to approach them with a sort of marketing pack explaining exactly why you believe they'll be successful based on their existing locations and on, on, not on some kind of whim or potentially some flawed catchment profiling. So I think there's lots... Uh, to cover and Ava no doubt will cover it and technology and everything else is key but I think it's very important to understand the role that the city centre has but also the ring of fire which Coventry has as well with a number of retail parks standalone stores sitting right um, outside uh, and as a visitor myself to Coventry I've been to IKEA on a number of occasions um, I think you've got a great opportunity but I think it's about importantly understanding what you have now what you could have and how uh, you work uh, part of the regional plan uh, that Coventry sits within because consumers are working very much at a regional level and not just a city level. So I very much hope that we can work with you in the future at Coventry and look forward to answering any questions uh, that you may have and I look forward to myself being someone who lives in the East Midlands coming to see you in person uh, and once again I apologise I cannot be with you uh, today. Thank you.